Hey everyone, Kathy here with Sophia and Watson and our Black Lab Riley. Just want to catch up with you guys. Can you believe it's been one month since our trip to the vet for artificial insemination? And I wanted to talk to you about some signs that we're seeing from Sophia that she may be pregnant. First off, I want to talk about her activity level. Normally, we want to go for walks two or three times a day. She loves her walks. But now we're down to one a day in the morning and the rest of the day, she's chilling and napping. And the second sign that we're seeing is that she has a slight mucus discharge. It's a little milky to clear and she's been cleaning herself uh, more frequently. And the other thing that we're seeing is that she is our independent, strong-willed Swissy, and she has turned into a clingy, affectionate Swissy that we are truly enjoying. Normally, we go to her and pet her and hug her, but now she is coming up to us and wants to be pet, hugged, and kissed. And we like that change for sure. And I want to talk about um, the things that we haven't noticed. We haven't noticed any nipple color change. We haven't noticed any weight gain. But then again, we're only four weeks out. So is she pregnant? I don't know. Sometimes I think that she is in other days, maybe not. But if you look back at the process that we've been through, and like the two separate blood work that we did for her progesterone level and doing the artificial insemination, we did it two days back to back. Also, you know, there is one thing I forgot in the first video on the artificial insemination. When we took them in to have that done, after they collect from Watson, um, they do a sperm count. They put a drop of his sperm underneath the microscope and then they count his sperm and he came back at 2.5 billion and that's an above average number so with that being said how could she not be pregnant so our next step is going to be ultrasound and the cost for the ultrasound is 139 dollars um i don't know if you didn't see the first video we're actually in florida we're from minnesota we usually take a month and we come down to Florida. So we're going to do the ultrasound when we get back in town. So we scheduled it and at March 19th, um, we're going to do the ultrasound. And the ultrasound will tell obviously if she is pregnant and how, just an estimate on how many puppies that she will have. And then a possible, you know, a due date or within a week or so. But gosh, I hope uh, this video was helpful for somebody. They're not too active today. Like I said, we're in Florida, but it's a good breeze. It's not too warm today. It's actually only like a high of 72 and very windy. But um, so after the ultrasound and we're back in town in Minnesota, I'm going to shoot another video and tell you what we discovered. All right, we'll see you guys in a week and a half or so. Take care. Bye.